Hi folks, Scott Sager with you again here today. Uh, today I'm in the studio with Dustin Scheidler from the Fulton County Relay for Life. He's part of the events committee and uh, the promotions lead, if you will. So he's going to tell us all about the 2019 Fulton County Relay for Life. Welcome. Thank you for having me. Dustin's Appreciate it. first time in the studio here, so yeah. I'll put you on the hot seat, so to speak. <laughs> so you are promoting the event, but uh, you're wearing many hats with the event. First of all, let's talk about the event itself. When is the 2019 Fulton County Relay for Life? So this year, we're actually about a week and a half out from okay. the actual event. It's going to be Saturday, June 22nd. Okay. Um, and we've actually had to change venues this year. Okay. We're normally at the school, and we've always been at school for the past few years, but they unfortunately sustained damage with the, one of the latest storms. Mm -hmm. So uh, we will be at New Life Church this year, just okay. off of 31. Okay. Um, they graciously opened their arms. That's and. great. Gave us a home for this year. It's going to be from 4 p.m. to midnight. Okay, 4 to midnight. Yep. And uh, we invite everybody to come out because we are kind of throwing out the traditional format and doing something we've never done before. Sure, you got a new venue, so that's going to force your hand to a little degree there. But, um, again, uh, you know what's happened at the high school. Some shards of glass, especially over there on the track and in the grass there. So they're having to deal with that situation. But... Uh, so New Life Church, again, thank you to them, uh, right across 31, 13th Street, right? That, that's correct. Okay. So they've got a nice uh, facility there, plenty of room in the back for all sorts of fun too, right? They were able to accommodate us for everything that's that we good. do, from the survivor dinner to uh, even a place to walk for those wow. that want to walk, um, right down to a kitchen where we can do all of our cooking <laughs> for the survivor dinner, so we couldn't ask for more. Big shout out to the folks with New Life. That's great. So talk to us about the changes that are going to be happening this year. So um, a lot of the uh, things that will be staying the same mm -hmm. for Relay, you'll still see the survivor lap and caregiver lap. That's a must. Yes. Survivor dinner, of course. Absolutely. Um, you'll see even some of the same activities that we've done in the past, such okay. as alligator wrestling, which is always a right. crowd favorite. <laughs> and we're actually doing that twice in the event okay. instead of just once. So if you don't get your opportunity the first time... Let's see what you can do. You, yep. I love it. Uh, but what we're doing this year, instead of having the traditional format, mm -hmm. we are doing a carnival-style Relay for Life. Okay. So basically, you're going to see a lot of games geared towards carnival. Nice. Um, we've got like a ping-pong toss. Nice. We'll have like cornhole boards nice. out there. Do I win a fish? Uh, you could win a fish. Okay, we can make I'm that in. happen. <laughs> Maybe a Swedish fish. We oh, might okay. make that yeah. work <laughs> for you. Fish, right? uh, but yeah, we're really excited because it's something we've never done before. And um, we're trying to draw out uh, the crowd. Mm -hmm. We're not charging to get into the actual carnival okay. relay itself. Great. Maybe a free will donation is all we're asking. Sure. Um, and then tickets to play the games are only 25 cents a piece. Nice. So very affordable for everybody to Absolutely. come out. Raise so, a little money to help for the cause. Takes care of some of the cost of it, of course. But Absolutely. then, uh, you know, it sounds like it's going to be just a good night of family fun. Um, and so, you know, in addition to the sentiment that goes with the uh, Fulton County Relay for Life, you've also kind of thrown in a little bit more of that carnival family fun atmosphere. So that's great. Absolutely. And that was our main goal. We wanted to go family friendly mm -hmm. and still gather for the same reasons yeah. to celebrate and remember. And uh, and give the kids something to do yeah. and 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 just make it fun. That's what it's about. Absolutely, especially the survivors uh, to go through there and uh, you know the pride that comes with it, the encouragement that comes with it as they continue to go through their rehabilitations. Uh, it's just great. It's great that everything that you guys are doing. Thank you. We appreciate it. A lot of hard work goes into it. Yeah, a lot of folks involved, too. So thanks to all the volunteers who are putting all this countless time. I know RTC had an auction here, a silent auction with some money being donated. I know other businesses are doing that. Can't thank you enough. It keeps the uh, spirit alive, so to speak. So. Absolutely. The community involvement is yeah. just astounding, That's and we great. thank everybody for making it possible for yeah. us to do this. I yeah. mean... Like I mentioned earlier, us ch having to change venues so yeah. close to yeah. the oh. event is a horrifying thought. Sure, right. <laughs> but um, the you know New Life Church really came to uh, together and, oh, and helped us with that. So if it weren't for them and, and other folks making it happen, really for Life of Fulton County may not have happened this year. Well, good job to everybody out there. Appreciate that. Now you, in addition to being on this committee and doing all these organizational type of things, you're, you've got a team, right? I do. I am team captain of Joe's Hope Relay for Life team, Excellent. and we've done quite a bit of things all around the town, all around Rochester. 
Um, I have been team captain since 2013. Wow. And I've been told that I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> so I'm kind of stuck there. Not that I would change it because That's it great. is such a blast to yeah. be able to lead the team. And, and a big shout out to my mom, Angie McNeese. She's my co-captain. Great. If it weren't for her, I couldn't do it. So, <laughs> Good job, Angie. Yeah, thank you very much, Ma, for, for doing great. that. What got you involved? My brother. Okay. My brother was diagnosed with cancer in 2011. Okay. Um, and he fought for a long time. Yeah. Three-year battle and he lost his battle February 14th okay. and um, he he was 19 when he passed mm. and you know he really he really inspires us yeah. to to do it and he's been gone five years mm. this year which is a I don't know if you call it a milestone but yeah. it's really pushing us that much more sure to uh, to make this happen yeah. and so he, he's our inspiration Good. Um, you know Joe's hope that's where our name came from it was Joe's hope that they would find a cure, not in his lifetime, yeah. but his nieces and nephews, because yeah. they were his world. Yeah. So that's where our name come from, was Excellent. that was his hope they'd find a cure. That's fantastic. And, you know, they keep making strides, and we keep having the promise that it's coming. But, uh, you know, that day will come, and it's things like this that continue to perpetuate all the research that goes into it. And I think, uh, you know, one of the most touching pieces of the relay is the luminaries, of course, yes. for those that have passed. And so that is um, somewhat cathartic to those that are... Uh, grieving their loved ones that have passed and it's a good time to come together for everybody so i can't thank you enough i really can't yep. um, thank you very you much keep it up you folks need to get out there now this is the 20 second tell me june uh june 22nd june 22nd yep. okay yep it's june a week 22nd. from this saturday a week from this coming yep. saturday you may see this a week from now so just remember the 22nd again it's from 4 p.m to midnight. Yep. If you have any questions, where can they go? Um, so there's three easy ways that okay. people can sign up. Um, they can either go to www.relayforlife.org. Great. I'll put that on the screen for yep. you. And uh, they can just follow the prompts. So if you want to either just sign up to walk. Yep. Or if you want to create a team or just join a team, all the prompts are there on the website. Excellent. So RelayForLife.org. Yep. And they'll be able to pick Fulton County and then yep. they'll, again, prompt you all the way through it. All the way through. Excellent. It's a quick One three minute shot. process. I don't know what's stopping people right. like, to come out because <laughs> all of us have been touched one yeah, way or another. Absolutely. So they can go to the website. Um, if you have a, a mobile device, mm -hmm. which most of us do these yes, days, of course. you can actually go into the Play Store. And download the American Cancer Society app. Okay. And you can um, sign up that way. Okay. Just American the same Cancer prompts. Society app on your smartphone, whether it's an Apple or an Android, I'm sure they've got both. So yeah, they've fantastic. got both. Yep. And uh, I forgot to mention that people can also donate through both of these Great. sources as well. Great. So you just follow those prompts as well. Everything's secure. You know, that's yes. a big thing these days. Absolutely. So everything's secure. They don't have to worry about legitimate that. Legitimate sites with legitimate money's going to the right place. Absolutely. Okay. Um, but they can also call Amy Calvert. Okay. She is our event lead. Great. Um, and her number is 574-835-0367. Mm -hmm. 8350367. I'll yep. put that up on the screen for you as well. Yep. So uh, you'll be able to give Amy Calvert. Amy Calvert. Uh -huh. uh, a call. Amy, uh, thank you for all you're doing, taking all these phone calls. Uh, if you get too many of them, it's our fault here at RTCT <laughs> before. We, we, we want that problem. Yeah, we promote well. But uh, well, great. A lot of good people. Anybody else just a shout out? Um, it's probably would, a list too many. Yeah, right? a list way too many. Okay. You know, I would I would like to just thank the community for yeah. coming together, yeah. um, the people on my team for making it happen, yeah. the people on the event leadership team for, you know, we really faced a lot of hurdles this oh, year. Oh, I can't even imagine. And it's been in one of our toughest years, Good. but we are going to make this happen yeah. no matter what. So a big shout out to, to those folks and just everybody who... Yeah. who comes out and supports us and and we like to thank you guys for oh, making this pleasure. interview possible our and pleasure we're going to try and get out there folks uh, i don't know if we'll be able to go live we may try to go live libby woodrick uh, does quite a bit of magic to uh, pull this stuff together so we'll see what libby can do and uh, perhaps we'll be able to get out there live if not i'm sure there'll be photos up on social media and all sorts of activities uh, throughout the night but again it's june 22nd it's four to midnight it is at New Life Church. That's the big announcement because of the changes with the high school. So once you go across the highway there over to New Life Church, thank you to them for putting it, you know, 
just opening their doors and their hearts, right? Absolutely. If it weren't for them, like I said, it might not have happened might, this year. They'd be holding it at the Scott's house. And, yeah. You know, it's, it's, it's a nice house. I don't know if we could fit everybody. Yeah, absolutely. But We'd make it work. We would. <laughs> well, thank you again, uh, Dustin. Thank you to everybody out there who's been a part of this. Uh, we all know somebody who's been uh, diagnosed or even fallen from this uh, fateful disease. And uh, we're going to do our best to continue our plight to uh, eradicate this disease from the planet. And uh, that's what this is all about, bringing people together, family, fun, fellowship, and uh, just in good remembrance of those that have passed as well. So, uh, again, thank you for watching here on RTC TV4. I'm Scott Sager. We'll see you next time.